Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. As you use up your other current asset, you enter each change to the value of the account as a general journal entry. Take the prepaid rent example from the last lesson into which you have placed your six months of rent. For each month after that, you can then subtract the amount of the rent from the prepaid rent other current asset account and assign the value to the rent expense account through a general journal entry. To make a general journal entry, select Tasks from the menu bar and then choose the General Journal Entry command. This will bring up the General Journal Entry window. Now here you need to create a balanced transaction that can then be posted to the general ledger. So using the prepaid rent example, you'll set the date and give it a reference number. You'll then select the general ledger account for the rent expense. and then you'll debit it the amount that's being incurred for that particular month. You'll then select the prepaid rent asset account and then you'll credit that the amount. Note that to post a general journal entry you do have to have matching debits and credit amounts which is called posting a balanced transaction. At that point, you would note that the month that's used up by the entry in the description field. Then just click the Save button in the General Journal Entry toolbar to save the record and post the balanced transaction to the General Journal. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.